I'm also now at four o'clock today, a gun scare inside the King of Prussia Mall. Witnesses describe a chaotic scene after an argument ended with a woman pulling a gun in the food court. That woman then taken into custody by police this afternoon. It is Thursday afternoon. I'm Brian Taft and I'm Sarah Bloomquist. The big story on Action News is the panic inside the King of Prussia Mall today. No shots were fired, but stores were locked down as people went running for safety. Action News reporter Maggie Kent live outside the mall with the very latest on that chaotic ordeal that just unfolded inside Maggie. Yeah, Brian and Sarah for one family was back to school shopping that was disrupted when a word of a gun spread through the mall and then of course it spread panic as well. Police say that they are interviewing all of the women involved when one woman pulled out a gun in the food court. Chopper six overhead as a woman was taken into custody outside of the King of Prussia Mall this afternoon. She is now being questioned after Upper Marion Township Police say she showed a gun to a group of women who she was arguing with outside the Five Guys Burger Shop in the food court. That gun sent everyone running. David Ogleton was back to school shopping at the time with his 11 year old son. All of a sudden we see, you know, a couple hundred people running towards us from the food court and, you know, we're kind of looking and a guy runs by us and he goes, someone says something about and I don't think he wanted to scare anybody else. So he kind of just like made that the sign of like a gun. As police made their way into the mall, stores began to lock down. The stores are kind of closing their gates and, you know, they're going to the back, I guess, to the back of their stores. The gun was never fired. Police say shop and staff, though shaken, were not injured. I called my wife on the way back and I was, I was just saying like this is like we were saying this is one of like our not biggest fears, but it's just one of the things you always have to worry about now. And Ogleton says when he and his son got back in their car safely, they both had goosebumps after what they experienced. Thankful that no shots were fired. Again, police are investigating. They're interviewing everyone involved at the scene, including that woman who showed a handgun. They're also investigating whether she had a permit to carry. We're live outside of King of Russia Mall. Maggie Kent, Channel 6, Action News. Brian. Yeah, something no family should have to deal with. Maggie, thank you.